Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see by today's title, I have a collective haul for you. I've got stuff from Zaffel, Shein and Misguided. Loads of nice winter bits that I'm absolutely obsessed with and I can't wait to show you. So I'm just going to dive in. As always, I will have try-ons and pictures and prices and things left here along with links and stuff in the description box. So if you're missing any information whatsoever, you will find it over there. I'll also be leaving my Instagram over this side of the screen as well, should you want to go and follow that and see any of the pieces styled up. For sizing reference, I am a size 6 to 8 up top and a size 8 on the bottoms in UK sizing, so hopefully that should help you out along the way. The first item in this haul is actually a homeware piece, so I'm going to show you that first. And it is this gorgeous print. It looks like this on really gorgeous thick cardstock, and it's just a print of Venice. It is beautiful, it comes with like a little hangy thing. It does have um, a string to hang it up with as well, but I've not actually put that on yet because this is actually a gift. So I made this on a Mappaful. I don't know whether you've heard of this brand before. I will leave some of their details and things over here but they're basically a bespoke personal print company and I just think it's super, super cool. So they reached out and asked if I'd want to create my own print and of course I said yes. This is actually a gift for my boyfriend. So we met at the very beginning <laughs> of the year. So travel has been completely off the cards for us, but we love travel. We would love to travel together and the first place on our list is Venice. So I thought it'd be a really nice personal gift to give him a Venice print as a little memento to say, you know what, we will go one day. He's also in the process of buying his first house as well. So I thought this would be a really bespoke, perfect gift for his first home. You can completely customise your print as well. So obviously I've chosen to do Venice. You can zoom out, zoom in as far as you want. You have the name of the place and the coordinates. I chose to actually get the spelling of it in Italian rather than Venice just because that would be my boyfriend's personal preference But there's so many different designs as well So there's loads of different colorways, but also they do things like star signs and constellations So if you've got a special date or whatever that you want the constellations printing out for they do that as well They have so many beautiful designs. So this is the one that I chose. I hope he loves it. He does know it's coming, but I still think I'm going to wrap it up for Christmas so it's something special. So if you're interested in prints like this that are just a little bit more personal, I will leave the Mappaful website linked down below in the description. But yeah, I absolutely love it. The quality is amazing and I'm so excited to give him it. And I'm also really excited to go to Venice one day. <laughs> Moving into the clothing pieces now, so I'm going to start with Zara and the piece that I am actually wearing. So this is part of their Limitless Contour collection and I am obsessed. I've got a few pieces to show you, but this is the first one. It's basically just a little ribbed crop top with really stretchy straps. It's very similar to the Out From Under collection from Urban Outfitters. I just love the quality of these pieces and they're so gorgeous. So this colour is in chocolate. I will show you the try on so that you can see it a little bit better. But then I did also pick it up in another colour as well and that is this one. I'm not actually sure what they call this on the website but it is stunning. It's just a really soft kind of oatmeal colour. I really really love this. I am really enjoying neutrals at the moment if you couldn't already tell by everything that I'm wearing and my recent hauls on this channel. But yeah I absolutely love it. It's super stretchy, super comfortable. The sizing on these are a little bit weird. So these ones are in an extra small to small but then I think they go from that to like medium to large it's a bit of a weird situation so personally I would like it a little bit tighter so that it would be a bit more supportive but honestly they're still such a staple and they're really really comfy so I've been wearing these to death already they wash pretty well I do think they'll get a little bit bobbly eventually but compared to the price of things like bow and tee where you're paying for these tones and that ribbed fabric but for so much more expensive. I don't think you can complain about the price of these ones. They're really, really affordable. So they're the tops in the collection. And then I did also pick up a pair of leggings. These are the leggings. So these are the chocolate color. So they do match the little top that I'm wearing now. So it makes a really nice outfit if you just want to chuck these on almost like loungewear, just with something like this thrown over the top. Or you can mix and match, which I really, really like. Again, these are in the extra small to small. They fit really nicely. They're so comfortable and the amount of compliments that I've had already is unbelievable. Disclaimer, I'm a teacher, it's students that are giving me the compliments, I'm not just gallivanting during lockdown. But yeah, these are super comfortable, really, really lovely to wear. I'll leave a couple of pictures of this styled up as well for you to see. But yeah, I just think they're an absolute staple. I would love to get all the other colours. And I think, to be honest, the price isn't bad for these. So I might pick up some more. And the other couple of bits that I picked up from Zara are some trousers. Now I've got two different pairs and one of them doesn't fit me. So I'm actually going to have to wait until they open again to be able to take these back. 
because I did buy them in store before lockdown rather than buying them online which was a little bit silly in hindsight. So these are the Zara Legging High Rise in a size small. This is what they look like. Let me see how much these ones were. They were £20, £19.99. So it's what it says on the tin. It's just a really nice legging. They do have a seam like halfway down the leg and they also have a zip at the side which is really really nice. So it is that split hem trouser effect as well which I've been really really enjoying. It's also got a popper system instead of a button on the front which um i'm not entirely sure how much i love that i think i would prefer a button especially if you're gonna eat in these it might you know pop up and if you've eaten a little bit too much but then it does have a really nice quality zip in there as well it's like a faux suede on the inside as well so it's going to be really really comfortable to wear they just don't fit me very well but the color is absolutely divine so i might have a little think about picking these up in the correct size but i do have another pair to show you that do fit me better so as i said these ones are in a medium these are slightly different but they are the same price this time they do have a seam running all the way down the leg it's not too clingy but it's equally not like a baggy trouser this one doesn't have a closing at the front it's nice and clean across the front and it's just a simple zip down the side which is really nice and it's also quite concealed as well they have done like almost uh, a seam down the side which is really really nice this one is a much lighter color i wasn't sure whether i'd love this on me because i thought maybe from far away i might just look a little bit naked um but i do really like the way they fit again it's the same faux leather that they use and again a really soft faux suede on the inside as well for zara pricing i really don't think that's bad at 20 pound for a really decent pair of faux leather leggings um, I'm very impressed. Moving on to Misguided, I just have one pair of shoes to show you and my lord, am I obsessed with these. These are my favourite boots, I think, ever and I love my docks. Oh, I absolutely adore these. These are what they look like. I have worn them out a couple of times so they are looking a little bit mucky around the edges but they are amazing. Granted, they make my feet look huge but I don't mind. They give me a bit of height. I am five foot three, so having that like extra two, three inches in the sole really helps a girl out. But yeah, these are their full leather and canvas boots. I actually picked these up in a size four originally and I'm kind of between sizes. I'm like either a three or a four and these were massive in a four. So if you're between sizes, definitely size down. So I managed to get a three eventually. I just had to keep refreshing because they were selling out 24 seven. They do have that full leather all the way around the front making them really nice and waterproof in this section. But then it is canvas up top as well, which to me just makes them look more expensive. These weren't that expensive, but they are just gorgeous. And again, I've been styling everything in neutral at the minute and they just go with everything. I just think it's a really statement boot to have. I am definitely a simple black boot kind of girl, but I'm really trying to step out of my comfort zone and I think I am managing that with these because I love them. The last pieces I've got to show you are from Shein and I'm going to start with some accessories because they are beautiful. Shein just seems to get it right every time. So this is the first thing and it is just a little shoulder bag. It is adorable. It's one of those really squishy gathered ones that looks really really expensive. The strap is detachable as well so you could wear it as a clutch, you can wear it as a shoulder bag but also it does come with a long strap as well. This is the length of that one and it is also adjustable as well. It does have almost like a belt detailing as well so you can tighten it or loosen it or whatever which is really really nice. I just think the colour of this is gorgeous. Again it's that kind of chocolate brown. It's a really rich colour which is absolutely beautiful. It's got silver hardware which I would have preferred if it was gold but honestly it's that subtle that I don't think it makes that much of a difference. You can dress it up, have it as a clutch or a shoulder bag but then equally I did style this as a crossbody bag as well the other day so I will leave that picture there just so that you can see that but I absolutely love this and it's super super affordable. The next piece is a hat and I love this. It's super super simple and this was under £3 which you just cannot go wrong with. I think that's amazing. So it's just a simple little beanie. It's like that kind of porridge oatmeal kind of colour. Really, really nice. And it's just got a little tag. It does say black style favourite on it, but honestly, you can't see that unless you're super duper up close. And from far away, it just kind of makes it look more expensive in my opinion. But again, can't go wrong for less than three pounds. I think it's a super cute colour and I have worn this already on some of my lockdown walks and it has kept me nice and warm. So cannot complain about that. Sticking with those really rich tones, I've got a little bit more of a dressier item and yes, I can't wear this right now, but I cannot wait to wear this when lockdown is over, if that ever happens. Haha! <laughs> this is going to be really difficult to show you without doing the try on, so hopefully you'll be able to see better there. But it is basically this little satin crop top, and it's got this gorgeous 
gathered high neck it is absolutely beautiful the color of this is divine and then it's basically just got this long strap that goes around the back which is just gorgeous i feel like i'm running out of words to describe things with but i am honestly obsessed i think it is a really expensive looking item when in actual fact it was super super affordable so this i got in a size small for reference and it fits like a dream this with just some wide leg trousers in a black or even in another neutral tone like a cream or an even darker brown would just look absolutely beautiful i just hope we can get to wear things like that this year but i picked it up anyway because even if i can't wear it this year i think it's one of those pieces that will carry through to times in the future as well I don't think this is something that will go out of style and equally I think this could carry through into the summer months as well because obviously it's quite backless you could wear this on holiday with some little shorts and things on an evening meal as well so even if I don't get to wear it this year I can wear it in the future the next piece I will definitely be getting some wear out of and it is just this white oversized shirt if you saw my last haul I did buy a misguided shirt dress but to be honest it was a little bit too big and a little bit too long for my liking so I popped on to Shein and lo and behold they had something that was perfect so it is basically just a simple oversized shirt it is long enough to wear as a dress I think they do advertise it as a dress to be honest um but you could wear it in whatever way you wanted it does have this little tie up detail at the side which is really cute I think if you're wearing it with a sweater vest that'll just add something a little bit extra if you want that popping out the side you could just tuck that away and no one has to know it's got this really lovely little dip hem on the side again you will be able to see that better in the try on section but I just love this you can layer this really really easily with some trousers some leggings you could wear it with a corset top and some boots on a night out you could honestly do anything with this top I'll leave some inspiration on screen for you to see but you can literally do anything with these kind of shirts super super versatile really affordable I got this in a size small for reference it fits perfect so if you're thinking oh maybe oversized for this I would just stick to your normal sizing it is absolutely perfect and it's not overly sheer either it's a really nice quality shirt which I am really really impressed with the next thing is a lounge set and I love this it is a little bit of a trend piece but we'll get over it I think I'm gonna really enjoy it so the first thing is this wide leg pair of trousers super super stretchy these are a little bit long on me not so long in the leg but just more in the torso so I might roll these down or even kind of take up the crotch area a little bit do you know what I mean because they come a little bit too high and are a little bit baggy but if I roll them over once they're a perfect height for me so if you're a similar height to me five foot three or shorter just bear that in mind but I absolutely love how comfortable these are again got them in a size small and they are pretty perfect on the length they're just a lovely wide leg trouser they don't cling too much to the leg but equally they're not too billowy that they just look like a dress really really nice and then the top is the thing that is the trend piece but I just needed to give this a whirl and because it is so affordable and comes in a set I just don't think you can go wrong so it is basically a little shoulder pad crop top it's almost like a little mock neck as well so all the trends coming through here but it's got these big shoulder pads in it which I actually really enjoy it does give you some structure so you could wear this out and about again with a jacket a shacket um, some trainers or some chunky boots and you could get away with it it's not one of those pieces that's like it's your pajamas why are you wearing pajamas out of the house it's one of those pieces that you can either wear all together running errands and things like that or you could dress it up with heels and some nice jewelry and it, no one would bat an eyelid but equally you could just pair this with jeans you could pair that with either a jama top or a chunky jumper or whatever and you'd be absolutely fine so again i think this is such a versatile piece and i'm really really excited about it they do this in other colors as well so definitely have a little look online at these because they're really really cute and as always i have saved my favorite thing till last and i am obsessed i will be leaving pictures of this that i've already taken wearing this so that you can see it styled but it is this jacket it is quite thin but I don't mind that at all because it just means that you can layer oh I absolutely love it I got it in a size small again so don't go oversized it is oversized anyway it is basically this cream faux leather jacket with contrast stitch in black which I just think is gorgeous it does have fake pockets which isn't actually that usual for Shein usually they do have built-in pockets but to be honest I don't mind it's more of a statement piece for me anyway rather than something overly practical but to be fair because it's faux leather 
and it's waterproof so you can't complain it's really oversized and it's got really big kind of lapels on the front as well the contrast stitch is also on the shoulders as well so it's just it's just so different I just paired this with my coated jeans and a black turtleneck and some black sunnies and it was just such a simple outfit so you can just chuck on a jacket like this onto a bog standard outfit and it just elevates it which I really really like but equally again you could dress this up if we're ever allowed out and we can have Christmas parties which I am presuming we won't but hear me out you could probably wear a really gorgeous black dress under here with heels and then just pop this over the top and it's a really nice layering piece as well for a night out so again I love it the neutrals are just having my heart apparently I just cannot stop buying them but this I absolutely love love so they are all the pieces that i've got to show you this time please do let me know which piece you liked the best down below in the comments if you did enjoy the video please do give it a big thumbs up because it really does help my channel out and if you haven't already please do feel free to subscribe i've got plenty more videos coming up very soon and lastly once again i'll be leaving my instagram over here should you want to have a little look have a see of some of those pieces styled up in detail have a little bit of a closer look but thank you so so much for watching and i will see you in my next one bye